The Chicago Cubs hosting the Tampa Rays, and the Rays are minus 150 on the money line. The Cubs are plus 130. I have the over under at eight runs, and Tampa Bay laying a run and a half at plus 115, which would mean they'd have to win the game by two, and Chicago getting a run and a half at minus 160, meaning they could not lose the game by two. Now, McClanahan did not pitch against the Cubs last year, so there's that. Hendricks did not pitch against the Rays either last year, and they're playing a lot of these over-unders and the run line on this really close to the hip. I had to search like 15 different sites to even find something that resembled a run line and an over and under. Now, Tampa Bay is on a one-game winning streak. Chicago is on a one-game winning streak. Tampa is 7-3 and three in their past 10 against the Cubs. These teams haven't played each other since 2017, and the team getting a run and a half is 7-3. and three. Now, McClanahan has not been pitching very well this year, but neither has Hendricks if you look at the run line. I'm going to take Tampa with the money line. I will take Tampa laying the runs. I think they're going to win this game by more than two, and I'm going to go over the eight. I think this will be like a 5-3 to three kind of game. Let's see if I'm right. Let's see if I'm wrong.